guys high five silver here a uh, little update video on the ceramic coating for the uh, crucibles that uh, ended up uh, I mean it was okay it uh, it uh, saved the outside for quite a while uh, but the inside inside still deteriorated on me so I decided uh, what I'm gonna try to do because I could not find one anywhere online and I even called the company and asked them if they had a uh, instead of a graphite crucible um, uh, if they had a ceramic crucible fully ceramic crucible uh, for these uh, for these bench top models of uh, hardened uh, furnaces and they said no so I did some research and got online started looking around and I came up with this uh, from what I found the best um, ceramic pourable ceramic mix uh, it ends up being this stuff right here it's good to 4,000 degrees so I'm gonna mix some up I made a mold a rubber mold out of this crucible right here and uh, I made my mold cut it open and uh, got it back together and I poured in the ceramic mix just did that a little bit ago Let's see what it looks like here when it's all mixed up kind of like cement or so maybe some runny cement but it's supposed to be good to 4,000 degrees <clears throat> rather than buying these about every 15 to 20 pours which pisses me off because you know they're like 30 to 40 bucks a piece uh, I'm hoping to get an extreme long life out of a fully ceramic crucible rather than graphite um, I'll do some more updates over this this baby's got a sit for a day 24 hours before I can get it out of the the rubber mold and uh, we'll see what happens um, you guys maybe you guys have already done this before uh, but I just hate buying these uh, all the time uh, and you guys at poor silver know we go through quite a few of them so um, give me your thoughts uh, maybe you guys have already done it maybe I'm out of my head uh, but uh, we'll see how it goes and I'll update you in a later video um, might uh, just put this aside and do some more silver pouring tonight or silver polishing don't know which one yet but uh, okay guys tell me what you think like share to all the guys that uh, that pour silver or pour gold or whatever you're pouring um, if you guys know of anybody that's already done this, let me know, um, and, uh, how it turned out for them. If not, I will let you know how mine turns out. So, we'll talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching.